Hello, welcome to lesson 51 in our HTML and CSS section in Free Code Camp. Today, the lesson is override all other styles by using important. Yay, we just proved that inline styles will override all the CSS declarations in your style element. But wait, there's one last way to override CSS. This is the most powerful method of all. But before we do it, let's talk about why you would ever want to overwrite CSS. In many situations, you will use libraries. These may accidentally override your own CSS. So when you absolutely need to be sure that an element has specific CSS, you can use important. Let's go all the way back to our pink text class declaration. Remember that our pink text class was overridden by subsequent class declarations. ID declarations and inline styles. Let's add the keyword important to your pink text elements color declaration to make 100% sure that your H1 element will be pink. So as you guys can see, we have uh, we had that pink text class, and then as we added other stuff like blue text, um, pink text was overridden because blue text came after it. And then we added an ID of orange text, which uh, wiped away the blue because it was an ID, and an ID um, takes precedence over the class. But now they're telling us if we want to make sure that you know a certain style is um, takes precedence over any other one, all we would have to do is in our element, or actually in our style element we would uh, go to that style that we want to take precedence. Here it's the pink text. We gotta go to the color part where it says pink and we have to tell it that this is important. This is actually the style we want. And as you can see by putting this here, it turns it to pink, which means that it overrode orange text ID, blue text, and those are the two, and then we also have the color of white. So it did override the inline style, the class, and the ID. So when you want to make sure that a certain style is going to work, that's what this is for. Important. So I think that's it for this lesson. Your pink text class declaration should have the important keyword to overwrite all their declarations, and your H1 element should be pink. So we're good for this lesson. The crowd goes wild.